friends, this is James Stalin here, and I am back in sunny South Florida. Um, and let me tell you, I'm glad to be back. It is beautiful out. It is hot. Um, I'm riding around out here on the golf course right now. And what I did today is, uh, today's my first day back in Florida, and I wanted to get to work on getting everything um, going for my lawn maintenance business. Um, I do have a lawnmower to use, the only issue that, I'm, that I have is it's not ready to go yet. There's definitely some issues going on that I'm working on with it. And I'm going to show you what those are right now. This is the mower that I have to use. Um, it's not the greatest thing, it's definitely seen better days, but it, act it actually is a really good motor. The engine is really strong. Um, it doesn't have a whole lot of time on it. The only issue uh, mainly is that it has been sitting outside for, not necessarily outside, it's been covered, but it's been sitting outdoors for, let's see, that oil filter says its last oil change was 2-21-2012, so, you know, quite a, quite a long time it's been just sitting, it, has, it probably hasn't been used since 2012, um, but very low hours on it, um, it was used just very briefly. Um, not everyday use, just occasionally. So, what I have planned for it is um, all new paint and get it, you know get it painted up, looking fresh again. I don't want to roll up on people's houses with a dirty old rust bucket lawnmower. Um, everything is very rusty. Like I said, it's been sitting, it's been getting wet. Um, so it is very rusty, uh, pretty dirty. Um, what I'm going to have to replace so far is the choke cable um, was completely seized up. I'm going to have to replace that. The gas tank, I removed the gas tank, I went to put gas in it, and the gas was leaking right out of the bottom. And what I noticed was the on the bottom of the gas tank, where the shutoff valve goes, this little rubber piece here that goes, that, that goes right here, that little rubber stop, um, it wasn't holding a tight seal anymore so I'm gonna have to get that replaced too um, the straps the straps on the gas tank were all ate up and rusted to death so those are going um, and this over here where is it I had to take apart this whole this whole side piece right here on the right side I had to take that apart and that bearing right there, that whole that, that bearing's got to be replaced. It's completely just rusted, you know, rusted tight. It's you know, it's completely frozen. So, but I mean, that sounds like a lot, but overall, this is a good mower. Um, it just needs a little love for sure to get it, you know, everything loose again. Everything you know, has been tightened up, hasn't been used for years. Um, I'm gonna get new filters, um, you know, pretty much all around. But yeah, like I said, everything is looking, you know, everything is going to be, you know, it's going to look brand new. Maybe not brand new, but it's going to look pretty new when we're all finished up. I'm also going to get this replaced up here that's pretty rusty. I mean, it feels like it wouldn't give me any issues, but like I said, I want it to look nice. So, like I said, this is what I'm working with. This is the first mower. It's not as good as my the last one I had. I used to have a Hustler 36 inch that I used, but hey, this is... Keep in mind that this mower was completely free. I'm not having to pay anything to use this. The engine is, you know, the engine is, you know, is good. The engine's not frozen up or anything like that. Um, so it'll run. It'll run strong, very low hours. And like I said, once again, free. I'm trying to keep my costs low. So this is what I'm going to be working with. And um, I'm going to come back and uh, do some more work on it tomorrow, and I'll film some more video. I appreciate you watching. Once again, like I said, I'm back in South Florida um, where the weather is, I mean, it's hot, but I'm starting to acclimate to it already from being in Colorado. Yeah, I'm right out here on the golf course. Like I said, it's beautiful out here. Um, but yeah, anyway, this has been James Dolan. Um, if you'd like to check the progress on my mower, like I said, I'm going to be posting more videos. I'm also looking for a truck, a trailer, and a blower. Um, have the have the edger and weed eater already, so um, I'm planning on getting those in the next couple days. I want to be up and running fast. Um, like I said, if you want to follow the progress on my mower, if you could, 
please just hit that subscribe button, like the video, um, you know, comments are always welcome, and I definitely appreciate you watching. Thanks, and peace out.